Like for example, if I had to choose if the enemy has an I-56 or an S-189, I would always give the enemy to the I-56 because S-189 is far far stronger than it's far stronger than I-56. Far stronger. Satchuk, thank you for the prime and welcome to, uh, to the prime. I say to the sub and welcome to the Uf army. That is really, really appreciated, my man. Anhalt has one good thing, and that's that this is barely any super structure. That makes it actually really cool. I have Dasha on Anhalt. Oh, I do. <laughs> no, I don't. Huh? Somebody else said that. Warte auf Anweisungen. Ende. But yeah, I know there's a lot of people coming in the, the future days. <laughs> they always say, yeah, look at this Flamo video. And, 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 and. One guy sent in a ridiculous match. Wow, I can do that in any other ship as well. Eventually. And he's not gonna have these games always. <laughs> you should be again, uh, from my opinion, after playing a lot of subs, you should be far more worried about an S-189, which is actually broken, or an alliance. These two submarines are actually really strong and broken on tier 8. Which I'm not surprised, because they're the premium ones. <laughs> Because the thing is, these two submarines can be played in a way, or at least let's say S-189, if you have basic understanding of the game, you are the better submarine than the enemy team, uh, than the enemy other submarines. Hey Ocula, welcome. Wait, do we have 6km torpedo range or 10? 6, okay. Oh, that's terrible actually. I thought that it had, I thought I had 10 cam tops for whatever reason, and it's also very slow. Man, that's a sad boat. We should have brisk on this. Concealment seems to be pretty good though. Why do I remember that Analt had 10 cam tops? Man, I haven't played the ship in ages. Imagine if you like one shot that Nagato now, how people would scream. <laughs> yeah, but I, <laughs> oh, that would have been actually pretty hilarious. No joke. Just for fun and giggles. I don't think we're gonna get the Citadel, but it would be funny. Wait, they have a secondary built on this. Are the secondaries that good? What is the range on the secondaries? 10km, okay, interesting. Apparently we have a secondary built on the ship. I don't know why I would do that, but I'm gonna just leave it like it is now. Torpedoes direct voraus! Torpedoes voraus! Oh wow, this is actually re this is actually a pretty good thing. It stops and turns very quickly for a BB. Torpedoes of Steuerbord in the Luft, in the Luft. No. Problem gelöst. Bro, the shells look so slow. Fire alarm! 
Warte auf Anweisungen. So one fire wouldn't have damage counted anyway, so I don't mind. In der Luft. Warte auf Anweisungen. In der Luft. Torpedos auf Steuerbord. Wir haben einen gegnerischen Zerstörer versenkt. Warte auf Anweisungen. Ende. Torpedos direkt voraus. Unser Team hat die Führung übernommen. In der Luft. Die Torp. Gegnerischer Kreuzer versenkt. Torpedos auf Steuerbord. Warte auf Anweisungen. Ende. Torpedos auf Steuerbord. In der Luft. Torpedos auf Steuerbord. Ich denke, das Submarine should be dead, ja. Yeah. Auf Anweisungen. Ende. In der Luft. Du wirfst nach Pentos Citadel und wird sie. No. Feindliches U-Boot zerstört. Warte auf Anweisungen. Ende. The Nagato in my broadside is a bit annoying. <laughs> But apparently we have a turtle back, at least we're holding against Nagato for now. Lookshots. This is the classic example now. This was a pretty decent game. Would I now say that Anhalt is still a good ship? Not really. That's a classic example. Does it now make the Anhalt broken? No, not at all. It's still a pretty terrible ship. But people always see just the result and be like, wow, that ship must be amazing. Look, this guy know I'm here and he's still gonna push out broadside on. So that's just a mistake by him. And nothing else to add. Careful. 
And at this range, I'm gonna hit him. No matter what. Look, he doesn't even have his guns ready for me. Kraken, come on! Yes! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Kraken, boys. The thing is, these guns are not even unreliable from the dispersion or something. They just have no pen. I think these are 350s, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, these are really garbage panning battleship guns. That's the problem. Good job! Apparently it's a secondary build. Would I build it into secondaries? Usually I wouldn't actually. I don't know. And this is the 8, remember. These are Koenig guns apparently, right? Nah, I think Koenig has 305s. I think Koenig has 305s, but I'm not sure right now. Doesn't Fritz Freifel Friedrich has these guns? That's why I think they're so terrible as well. GG Kraken and Anna is just a taste of its penis. <laughs> yeah, it's subtly broken guys. It's by far the best TA chip Must be right <laughs> GG mm.